Top 7 Incredible Human Survival Stories Human beings are pretty remarkable creatures. Take a look at everything we as the human race have created. From language, to architecture, to medicine, people are not only intelligent, they're also extraordinarily resourceful. That being said, when pushed to the limit, the human body is capable of withstanding some horrendously extreme conditions. Let's take a look at seven of the most extreme, difficult, and downright impressive survival stories of all time. And find out later the horrifically disgusting lengths some people have had to endure. We promise you'll more than likely want to take a shower. Number 7. Harrison O'Keen On May 28, 2013, Harrison O'Keen, a 29-year-old cook working aboard the Jackson 4, was using the washroom when his vessel was overturned after being badly weathered by heavy swells. Sinking 12 miles off of Nigeria's mangrove-lined coast, the vessel began to rapidly capsize around 5 a.m., with O'Keen unsuccessfully scrambling from the toilet to reach an emergency exit hatch. Watching several of his crew members get sucked into the sea, he was then pinned in the small latrine cabin 30 meters below the freezing waters, with only his underpants for warmth and four square feet of bubbled air to breathe in. Spending an approximate 60 hours underwater, a team of South African divers finally came to his rescue. Number 6. The Robertson Family Keeping with the theme of the sea, let's take a look at these fellow water prisoners. Although this family spent their time on top of the Lonely Blue, in 1971, British dairy farmer Dougal Robertson set out to take his family of six on a boat trip dubbed the University of Life by one of his sons. Although the patriarch was formerly in the British Merchant Navy, his ill-preparedness cost his family a perfect trip. Encountering a group of killer whales near the coast of the Galapagos Islands, their boat was severely damaged leaving the family to survive on a tiny lifeboat, a small dinghy, and six days worth of food. After 16 days, the family was left clinging to just the dinghy, finally being spotted and rescued by Japanese fishermen. Number 5. Ada Blackjack 1921. Alaskan native and member of the indigenous Inupiat people, Ada Blackjack was hired by two Canadians to accompany them as a seamstress and cook on a takeover expedition to the Wrangell Islands in what is now Russian territory. When the crew arrived on land, they set up camp. After running out of supplies, Blackjack was eventually left alone on the island after three members left to seek food. Spending almost two years stranded and surviving on her own, not to mention avoiding the constant indigenous threat of polar bears, she was finally rescued in 1923, tragically arriving home to severe backlash and living in poverty until her death in 1983. Number 4. Douglas Mawson in 1912, Australian scientist Douglas Mawson set out on a brave but otherwise flawed mission to explore the depths of Antarctica. Returning back to base camp on December 14, 1912, one of Mawson's accompanying colleagues fell into a crevice, dragging their sledge, supplies, food, and even most of their dogs into the deep below. Left stranded a staggering 310 miles from home, the two men were forced to brave the icy tundra, eventually only leaving Mawson alive. Suffering from massive conjunctivitis and frostbite, he survived a total of 32 days before reaching his hut, only to wait another 10 months for a ship to return him to his native home. Number 3. Ricky McGee Another Aussie on our list with an extreme survival story is this rather uh, odd fellow. Waking up face down in the middle of the Australian desert in 2001 to dingoes attempting to eat him, he spent the next 10 days avoiding the perils of the outback, desperately trying to recount what happened between his last memory of driving and his most recent of being canine kibble, eventually setting up camp using twigs and branches near a water dam he found. McGee spent three entire months surviving on grasshoppers, leeches, and frogs, losing a dangerous amount of weight, and going through one of the most psychologically shaking experiences one could have. He was eventually rescued by farm workers and slowly brought back to health. Number 2. Marina Chapman Born in approximately 1950, Marina Chapman was only four years old when an unsuccessful kidnapping attempt left her stranded in the Colombian jungle. After a clan of capuchin monkeys took the young girl in, they taught her to forage, climb trees, and even hunt. After several years of stealing fruit and rice from nearby villagers, she was eventually captured and enslaved by mafia families until she was rescued at about 14 years old by a neighbor. 
Although the validity of her claims have been a hot-button controversy amongst the scientific and publishing community for years, time and time again, witnesses who recall the young girl vouch for the truth in this real-life Jungle Book story. Number 1. Coolidge Winnesett Alright, so this brave soul might not have spent as much time trapped or isolated as some of the others on our list but you'd be hard-pressed to argue that this one isn't one of the grossest cases of them all. This 75-year-old World War II vet was using his Southwest Virginia outhouse when the floor beneath him gave way from dry rot, catapulting the stroke victim, who was without the use of his arm and leg, into a deep reservoir of human waste below. The only thing keeping Winnesett from completely drowning was the partially submerged subfloor, holding him up as he spent three long days surrounded in pure… well, you know. Not to mention a bevy of snakes, rats, and spiders to keep him company. After noticing his letters were piling up, Coolidge's postman soon heard his weakened screams for help, sparking his rescue. Which of these cases of human survival was most shocking to you? Let us know! And if you love our lists, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe for new videos every week.